Uh, J. Dowdy, I guess they said the U.S. will not be uh, spared if they continue to fund the genocide. I, I agree. I think everyone realizes that. If the U.S., if the West continues to fund the genocide here, this is World War Three. Canada last week, two weeks ago, said, okay, they're not going to send any more weapons to Ukraine. But these are the liberal World Economic Forum globalist psychopaths, right? Their popularity is going down, and there's a new party coming into, it's going to take 2025, they're going to have the elections, right? The liberals and the NDP are going to hold on as long as they can. If this thing doesn't settle down by then, the conservatives that are going to win a super majority in Canada when the next election happens, they're going to send all the weapons that Israel wants. They're, they're full in there, fully on there, because they're going to hold branch of the evangelical born again christian psychopaths right and they're totally controlled by the zionist lobby right apac sort of stuff right they're trying to pass a hate law the same way they did in scotland which you if you if you say boo that's considered hate speech someone can sue you for tens of thousands of dollars and they could throw you in jail for thought crime that's the same that's canada that's the same thing as ireland scotland uk the commonwealth nations are going that route. That's why the commonwealth, commonwealth should be annihilated, right? Everyone should pull out of the commonwealth, decentralize that shit, right? But that's where we are. Like, it's pretty simple. It's pretty simple. I, seriously, I, I don't get it. It's, people need to have some critical thought and look at the 